I wonder what Mario is doing right now. I wonder if he's hurt. I'm so worried about him. He'll be alright, princess. Why, I bet he's saving some star spirits right now. Yes, yes, you're right, Twink. I must be strong. I need to concentrate on finding a way out of here. But there are tons of guards just beyond your door. And it's impossible for you to escape through the windows. <gasps> Wait a minute. I remember the minister telling me that there was a secret passage out of this room. Twink, help me look for it. Cool, great idea. <laughs> Hello everybody, my name is Ronnie Ungard, and welcome back for more Paper Mario. In the last part, we, uh, you know, took down the rest of Koopa, for Koopa Brothers Fortress, and in this part, it seems there is um, a secret entrance somewhere. I remember watching somebody doing a blind playthrough of this and, uh, you know, stumbling around this room for quite a while. Look, there's something behind this drawing. <gasps> I love how it just flips down. <laughs> and, you know, the button turns off the fireplace. <laughs> yes, cool, now we can get out of this room. Well, at least he's not. For some reason, I just... The fact that he's saying cool a lot makes me think of um, the Pokemon anime where there was there was a point uh, from Generation 2 to Generation 4 in the anime where they said awesome so much that, you know, you could actually count it in, like, in individual episodes. Like, it was crazy. Hey, look at this. It looks like somebody left a private diary just lying around. Should we read it? A little little. No, oh, you lo you like doing this sort of thing, do you? Tisk tisk. Okay then, very quietly. Let's see. D zero zero month star sunny. Today I went to Star Haven and stole the star rod. Now I'm invincible. Cool. I also captured those seven star spirits so they won't annoy me anymore. <laughs> <laughs> it was a hard day's work and I'm feeling pretty bushed. Dinner was nice, but a bit bland. <laughs> I feel like I might know the person who wrote this. <laughs> Should we read more? Definitely a little more. <laughs> okay, let's continue. Day 0x, month star, cloudy then sunny. Today was great, diary. I used my castle to lift Princess Peach's castle way up into the sky. Gee, I wonder whose diary this is. Then I barged into Peach's castle and beat up Mario. Yeah, unbelievable. I know, so fun. There's m <laughs> and there's more. After that, I kidnapped Princess Peach. I couldn't be happier, diary. I hope she likes me. <laughs> Bowser is so cute. Princess Peach, this is Bowser's diary. Ugh. Well, we do. She will read more. Uh, she, yeah. Day XX Month Star Sunny. Well, the Koopa Brothers got beaten by Mario Diary. Even set free that stupid star spirit I kept there. I'm so mad I can barely write. Oh, I'm Mario. I'm so big and strong and good and helpful and good looking and sexy and. <laughs> I hate him, but I'm not worried. There's no way Mario can save the star spirit that held in dry, dry ruins. Like how it's even in the diary, it's written in like important text red. <laughs> to do that, he'd have to solve the mystery of the sands and then find the dry, dry runes in the dry, dry desert. How would he even know to go there and do the desert anyway? So I'm not worried at all. In fact, I'm so calm, I'm gonna go to bed now. And whatever. Dry, dry runes in the middle of the dry, dry desert. <laughs> One of the revered star spirits is being held there. Twink, do you think we can act, you can find Mario and tell him that? <laughs> yes, of course, Princess Peach. I'll find Mario right away. Question mark, question mark, question mark. There he is. <laughs> oh no, I can't believe I left my secret diary lying out. <laughs> it would be so embarrassing if somebody read that thing. <laughs> <laughs> what? What's the princess doing here? <laughs> ah, you little sneak. You read my diary. <laughs> Just the fact that Bowser has a diary. 
<laughs> He's so cute. King Bowser, is there a problem? You're the worst guards ever. Take Princess Peach back to her room immediately. Yes, sir. Straight away. Forgive us, sir. You whoop. <laughs> no, put me down. <laughs> then Twink just follows. <laughs> that noise again. <laughs> Oh, Lord. Mario, I believe you will save us all. From the bottom of my heart, I appreciate all you've done. Thank you. Says you have freed me from my prison. The seal of my power is broken. I will recover it little by little. As long as it now is power remains in me, I shall help you. Oh! Oh, with sparkly. Mario can now use the Star Spirit's power in battle. Using a star power requires star energy. Would you like to listen while I tell you how to use star powers and star energy? No! <laughs> I suggest that you listen. It's very important. Do you want to listen? No! Alright, if you say so. I feel like there's, like, so many new games that could learn a little from this. Oh, looking at you, sun and moon. <laughs> Mario, listen carefully. You must save the other star spirits quickly. If the seven of us come together, we'll be able to bestow upon you a star power called the Star Beam. The Star Beam is the only thing that can counteract the star run the Bowser wields. I have to go back now, back to Star Haven. I must leave immediately, but I'll always be watching you. Always be watching you. Save us all, Mario. Fart, glitter, fart powers. Then we're just left to our own devices. <laughs> Let's just save, just, you know, to be completely safe. Whatever. <laughs> uh, I, I'm definitely going to explain this star power, you know, on my own, but, you know, it's, it's not really that hard to understand and explain, really, so... I, I, I feel like it's okay to skip, you know, the tutorial and show you myself, if, you know, it's super duper easy to explain. Ooh, the FP Plus badge, which, you know, I would, I could actually consider using, but I, but, hmm, I'll hold off, I'll hold off for now. Because <laughs> I, I, I feel like the entire point of doing the, no, actually, uh, let's take the time to explain the Star Spirit for now. As you can see right under the HP, we have a little star and a little, you know, stripe right next to it. The star is one of these powers. You know, you see here it says one pow. So it takes one of those stars to use this ability, which recovers HP and FP by five. And also cures poisoning and a shrink, which we, you know, <laughs> haven't even encountered yet. Yeah. And run away, because I just don't feel like dealing with this shit. <laughs> I, don't, I don't like that we lose coins from this, but um, I suppose it's inevitable. And, you know, we, we have gained a lot of coins from, you know, a lot of different things. You know, we've got the, the refunds and the whatevers and, sh and such. I'm kind of sad that this game doesn't run on the same, you know, logic of uh, Earthbound, wherein, you know, when you... Um, defeat the boss of the area, the enemies are just, like, <laughs> running away from you. Because I feel like, since we defeated the Koopa Brothers, the regular Koopas and other others would be like, oh, no, we shouldn't mess with Mario because he defeated our boss. But, um, <laughs> I guess they consider, you know, Bowser their, their boss, so we, have, we haven't truly defeated their ma master. <laughs> Just trying to avoid every enemy. I don't want to get into a fight, girl. I think... Wasn't there a... Spike? Boom. Hold it right there, Mario. I've been waiting for you. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> I told you I'd be back. Now I'll get my revenge. Here it comes, baby. Check this out. <laughs> He's so silly. 
<laughs> Mario, I'm talking to you. I promise you this fight will be much different from before. And he's actually right. Every every new fight with Junior Truba is going to have its new set of gimmicks. So, who is this crazed guy? What a nut. Shut up. You, Mario, of course you remember me. Who are you again? What? Darn it. You don't remember me? <laughs> Listen, you, you big lug. My name is Junior Truba. Remember it and tremble. <laughs> After this meeting, you'll definitely remember it. <laughs> and here he is, back again. Get ready to hurt Mario, I'm gonna show you a new skill that I just picked up. Hiding in my shell, no jutsu. Yeah, check that out. Never seen anything like it before, have you? Your attacks are useless now. And if this was before we got the star thingamabob, our attacks would be useless. Because, <laughs> you know, we could only do 1 HP at the time. Well, we did have power jump, but, you know, limited FP and all. <laughs> what was his name? <laughs> Junior Troopa? I don't remember ex exactly. Just joking, kid. My HP. Ooh, 15. Whoa. Tapper 1. No, Tapper 2. Defense power 1. Looks so adorable hiding in this thing, doesn't he? So cute. Should be a snap to beat him now, I think. Well, he does have it attack. Well, yeah, he just pops out of his shell and attacks us. Hmm, now, actually, yeah, I'll just change to Bombette and try to blow him to heck up. Press A repeatedly! Four damage. Death pretty good. Oh, damn it. Can't figure out the timing of that. Let's actually show off Refresh. Also, Focus uh, allows you to recharge your energy, but... Uh, Star, star energy, uh, you gain a little back every start of the turn, but uh, focus lets you get a lot of it back, so. <laughs> Praying to Jeebus, please help us. And 5 HP and 5 FP. That's, you know, th that's actually a very good ability to have, because, you know, uh, even, even if you're not, you know, crazy like me and doing challenge runs and shit, Having, you know, a, an ability that gives you back 5 F HP and FP um, for, you know, basically for free, that is really good to have. Now, we don't have a, a way to gain back FP. We could use an item, but I don't really think it's necessary. Actually, we, I could show off uh, focus, actually. Youch! Who knew the Mario had such battle skills? <laughs> oh, grr, it's not over yet. Yeah, and you know, still being able to hit him thanks to uh, this doing two damage instead of one. Still doing well. Now, now I've learned the timing of it. So <laughs> let's charge our star. And as you as you saw, we did have a little of it back, but this gives you know almost half of it back. So. It's, uh, pretty good. And I don't remember if it's this game, but I think you gain the ability to, um, have your partner's focus as well, which is incredibly helpful. Um, hmm. Nah, let's just try to beat him normally. We're, we're right next to a toad house, so that's not a big deal. Yeah. As long as I don't flub the action commands, the, we're gonna have them the, the next turn now. Oh, damn it! <laughs> well, I could still flub those action commands. <laughs> Jeesh! Jeesh! Don't cry! Gosh. <laughs> it's so finicky, that specific action command. And wow, we're already more than halfway to our next level up. <laughs> Yay! Ah! <laughs> oh, that's that's silly. <laughs> Actually, you know, shoot, Mario! Oh, it's a twank. Hello, twank. Mario, Mario, it's me, Twink. Remember me? <laughs> Who are you again? <laughs> I heard you say the Honorable Starspider was captured by the Koopa Brothers. 
Bowser and his gang are so angry about it. So angry. <laughs> I knew you could do it, Mario. You're on your way. Hmm. But enough celebration for now. I come bearing important information for you. It says that one of the Star Spirits is being held captive somewhere in the dry, dry desert. <laughs> but Bowser wrote in his diary some place called Dry, Dry Ruins. The princess braved the danger of the castle to get you this clue, Mario. Girl, she walked through a tunnel. Whatever. <laughs> nah. She, she it was brave to try to break out, you know. If you find out anything else, I'll hurry back to tell you. I have to get back to her highness now. She's so brave. I hope this news helps. Well, it, it did help Mario, but, you know, we as the player did already know, so... Ooh, actually, one thing I could do to kind of pass the time, because this episode is, you know, almost 16 minutes, so we have done a little bit, but I want to pad it out a little bit. Here is the ability to read letters, which, you know, you get a lot of letters throughout the game, but I'm, I'm not going to read every one of them, but I'm going to read maybe one or two. Let's read for Gumbario, because... Oh... <laughs> the red and blue Goombas. <laughs> I thought it was from his family, but I think that's later. Gumbario, you were a lot stronger than you looked. We figured you were about just, just some punk Goomba hanging around with Mario. Anyway, you proved yourself to us and showed us that being good is as important as being strong. So, when you come back, we think we may be, be friends. Please say yes. <laughs> we'll be waiting. <laughs> Aw, that's, that's kind of kind of cute. Actually, I think something that I want to do is... Ooh, ooh I wonder if the bad shop is open. <gasps> hey, mister! My dad's opened his shop. Don't you want to take a look? It's really cool. It's a bad shop for badges. Come on, check it out. Oh, hell yeah. A lot of rare badges. Take a very close look. First attack. Let's Mario destroy a weaker enemy with a first strike. Which, you know, is a lot of fun. <laughs> Gotta tell you. Then you have to D-Down Pound, which I remember I... I vividly remember picking this up on my first playthrough and being very happy about that. Because <laughs> uh, this is basically, um, you know, you go through the enemy's defense and hitting them. So I think I'm definitely going to buy that one. Bump Attack is pretty good, but I'm thinking I'm going to hold off on that for now. I, I could technically... You know, just sell something and go for it, but I think I also want a uh, multi-bounce, which is also pretty helpful <laughs> to uh, hit multiple enemies. But I think I'm gonna go and take out... Ooh, ooh, before I do that... <laughs> do that. The train part of the station at the south of town is pretty spiffy, isn't it? It's called K64. Of course it's a 64, jeez. Fortunately, a huge boulder has fallen on the track and the train can't go anywhere. Talk about a crying shame. A More Mario more than a match for the Koopa Brothers Fortress. Our hero Mario has vanquished the Koopa Brothers who live in the great fortress to the east. The Koopa Brothers long time underlings of Bowser. They left to guard one of the kidnapped star spirits. Star spirit says, Return to Star Haven, all thanks to our hero. Huzzah for Mario. How the hell do they get all these news? <laughs> What kind of fucking uh, reporter has, you know, like, friggin' followed us or whatever? Now, oh, oops. You can actually hear the dojo music. I don't think you should be able to hear the dojo music where we're standing. Oops. Let's claim the goon nut that we, um... Did, wait, did, did, we, did we get it? Oh, Jesus. Uh... Uh, yeah, okay. I, I, I thought he said something, you know, you can't carry more items or something like that, but apparently... I, I think he might have said that you don't have any more items. Ooh! Huh. Wow. <laughs> I just... Something just crossed my mind of like, hmm, I should hit that tree. <laughs> apparently that was a very good thing to do. Not, not that tree, though. Oh, well. Oh, it's Tasty. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, it's Mario. My name is Tasty. I love to cook. If you bring me ingredients, I'd be happy to fix you one of my energy-given dishes. Heart. Would you like me to cook something? Which ingredient would you like me to use? 
I would like to use this goom nut. <laughs> Take my nut. Then I shall cook with a goom nut hard. I'll wipe something special up just for you, honey. It'll be fabulous. Just a moment. Hard. <laughs> Tra la 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 la. Here you are. This recipe is not too bad. Here, please. Ooh, nutty cake. Mmm. <laughs> Come back anytime, hon. I look forward to it. I think I might actually want you to take a couple of. I think at least the mushroom can make us something pretty good. I don't know if I want to use. There's a part of me that feels like I shouldn't use the super mushroom for this. Ooh, fried shrimp, because I think uh, a super mushroom also makes this. So you would lose 4 HP to gain 2 FP, which, you know, some might say is worth it, but, eh, I don't, I don't really feel it like, like, like it's worth it. Uh, hmm, I think the fire flowers turn into something as well, but I don't remember what. Hmm, we could use one of her honey syrups and see what that makes, because I don't actually remember. <laughs> she cook with honey syrup. Don't remember if this alone creates something. I know, I know you can combine it with other items later. Oh. Okay. <laughs> it's just the same thing, except it also cures poison and uh, shrinking. Which, you know, is not very helpful. <laughs> Actually, because, uh, um, freaking, uh, you, you almost never encounter poison or shrink. Puff! Well, hello there. My name is Bubble. I came from Flower Fields, the wonderful land of flowers. I love to spread the wondrous flowers and flower fields all over your land. That, if that, if, if that didn't come from this cute flower in a Mario game that almost sounds sinister. <laughs> you like flowers, don't you? Of course you do. Who doesn't? For that reason, I'll address this to your care. Magical seed. <laughs> Girl, I gave you my magical seed. That is a flower seed. It's well if it's well cared for, a beautiful flower will bloom. Flower delicate, only only one with a loving heart can make the bloom make them bloom in beauty. Place a good care for it for beauty is fragile. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, this tree. Unlocks this pipe. And we're not gonna go in this pipe because we can't actually do anything in there. <laughs> and this. Oh. There there are some pig things you can get with this, but uh first of all, I don't actually How much does it go? Welcome to Toad Toad Town's famous little oink farm. Pay ten coins. Okay, we do. We do actually have enough for one. And yeah, it, it, it just tells you that. Uh, I love little oinks. Love them. You want to learn about them? No. Basically, um, for ten coins, you're able to get one of these uh, little pigs. Uh, and if you get ten, uh, well, uh, this pen can hold ten of them. But uh, if a if an eleventh one comes in here, then the first one. AKA this black one in this case will uh, skedaddle and leave a leave an item behind. Let's let me just pop on pop up on screen right now what the items are because you know I actually kind of want to learn that myself. So the, it, it would be a good opportunity for me for future me to Google that and find out himself because I know that he would want to because I want to do it right now. I love trains, don't you? I love. I'd love to come here and watch them come and go, but it doesn't seem to move at all but now. It's really a lot more fun to watch when it's moving. The problem must be that the gigantic rock on the tracks. <laughs> you think? I'm ruined. None for a huge rock is blocking the train tracks. When Peach's castle was uprooted, one of the bulls from that stack rolled off and landed here. What bad luck. We can't do something about a bolt or I can't make my run to Mount Rugged. And... Actually, I don't think they ever tell us this, but uh, Mount Rugged is where you have to cross to get to Dry Dry Desert. So, doing that was definitely in our interest. Oh, thank you, Oliver. The train is bound for Mount Rugged. Are you coming, Mario? 
we are in the next time. So I'm gonna see you guys in the next time. <sighs> Goodbye. That was a very awkward ending. <laughs> Oops. <laughs>